what's the most metal neighborhood in New York City? Most metal neighborhood gotta be Crown Heights, and I'll tell you why. See this mustard bottle? See this ketchup bottle? They look the same, but in actuality, they're two different colors. Crown Heights is a lot like this. You got Jewish people, and you got black people. They're the same. What was I gonna say? What is the most, what is the, what is the, what is the, what is the, what is the politically word? Like, what is this? Is this the Chinese people of Jamaica? Is that what you're saying, son? No, what is it? What are these no. Native Americans that we This is just a, yeah, this is just a bottle. Crown Heights is full of Chinese people and Native Americans. Asians. Damn. This is very racist. Damn. Damn. I can't it's the call the most that. metal neighborhood. On the outside, they look like they're two different things. But on the inside, same thing, air. Think Yo, about speaking it. of air, Canada just sold some air to China. That's They're right. Selling air. We finally polluted this friggin' planet enough that there's people out there who can literally make money by selling air. That's no, incredible. congratulations, you know world. China. Uh, that's China the most metal the most, city. Most metal city in New York. Beijing. China. Because there's Beijing. most metal in the air. In the air. Literally. I have one there's more. I have one more. Who is the hairiest metal artist? Oh. The hairiest metal oh, no. artist. Oh. Let's go. Let's go, guys. <laughs> The dude's from Waves. That one guy from Waves. The guitar player guy from Waves. Actually, I got a question too. Though. I got a question too. I got a question too. I feel I just have an answer. Actually, I feel like the most metal character in all of movie history is the six-fingered man from The Princess Bride. He was also the lead guitar player in Spinal Tap. But I feel the reason why he is the most metal is because he has six fingers, and you never heard a guitar player play guitar with eleven fingers. Damn. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this has been a wonderful episode of Heavy Metal Breakfast, and now we're going to send you out. You ready, fellas? Heavy Metal Breakfast. man. What? You do that for a long time, man. You're going to do the Saved by the Bell, man. Saved by the Bell, we're just like. Ooh, ooh. Alright, that's not good, okay? Shinobi Ninja! <laughs>